Your Excellency, uh, thank you for the opportunity for us to be here in Isiolo so that we can perform uh, this very important task from the Minister of Health. Uh, Your Excellency, when we started this process, we knew we were to visit uh, 10 hospitals and we had a team that has been uh, put together by our cabinet secretary, uh, China uh, Senator, uh, whereby uh, we were given four uh, counties, and one big is Yolo. The purpose of this task force is to ensure that we build capacities uh, in these counties in the relationship to with the uh, on the issues of COVID-19 preparedness to make sure in the case of a case happening within the county, that case should be managed within, uh, within a county. It summarizes this because the experts will be able to, to go in depth, will be able to provide specific uh, happenings in those particular hospitals which, which uh, we picked 10 hospitals. But let me say the first one, uh, in terms of scoring, uh, coordination, how well you were co coordinating these efforts. Your Excellency, let me tell you, the team is pleased to tell you, out of 15 uh, points that were allocated, Your Excellency, you scored 15, <laughs> maximum. That shows how you are prepared well, your team were trained, the coordination was done well, and we had evidence to back our findings. The second one was emergency response mechanism. How you are prepared to respond to emergencies. Your Excellency again, the score, maximum score was 10, and good news, you scored 10 out of 10, and that was excellent. Number three was essential medicines uh, that was needed to, to be in these particular hospitals. Uh, Your Excellency, the score we gave there was five, and you scored five. We found the evidence of medicine and drugs in new stores, and we are very happy to report that finding. Um, the other one was case management, um, and our team, they visited these hospitals, and each hospital that we, we visited, uh, the maximum score for that one was 20, and your excellence, you score uh, 16. So you are missing four points, but uh, uh, that is also very good but there is a room for improvement in terms of case management. We'll be able to go through this to see which hospitals we are performing better than the others and some areas of improvement in that area. Your Excellency also uh, testing, laboratory testing, uh, the maximum score. We know, we know the challenges that you are facing. You are working on this, but you are turned around. And now you are working to get the samples from Isiolo to Nairobi, to other areas that you are taking this. It's very commendable because you don't have a laboratory within the county. But that preparedness for you, it is, it is you score 16 out of 20. 16 out of 20, there's areas of improvement, but we appreciate that. The other one we looked was risk, uh, uh, communication and uh, publicity, uh, and that one again, we, uh, out of 20%, you scored 17, and that is also very commendable, and that is a good job uh, for that one. The other one is risk management, and risk management, Your Excellency, you needed to, to ensure you put a plan, uh, and when our team went through, 
we did not find that plan. We will still be working with your team to ensure you can have a plan in place so that we can be dealing with the risks, the, the issues of, of tomorrow and, and, and known to make sure we can be able to deal with them. We have uh, a good uh, uh, model so that we can be able to work with your team to establish the same. But risk management plan is an issue whereby we, we have to work on that. Then the other issue we looked was finance, the, the budget towards, uh, uh, towards COVID-19 and the cost management of the same and how well you are prepared in this and your excellency out of five points that we are located in this particular category, you scored five. And that we felt was excellent because you did not miss any point.